Consider this the condensed Coles notes of what I tried to get accomplished with my last video. Today is Monday, July 15th. Tomorrow is July 16th, meaning anyone who completed their 10 daily missions will be getting their Explorer package if they haven't already got it, and potentially we might be seeing our career summer update. Now, those of us who are skeptical about it have cited the idea that we've got one package available to us before the 16th with two other career routes, so it's possible we won't be seeing the update for another two weeks. Um, a lot of complaints amongst the community. Free stuff does not equal content. There was the infinite chess glitch that happened just this past week, which has really blown things out of proportion. So if you already had a sense of purposelessness, purposelessness or frustration with the economy, it's for sure blown out of proportion now. Uh, and the search for realism, perhaps we've neglected fun. You know, maybe that's the real issue with what's going on. I, I myself am surprised that we haven't seen any mutations or mods or more tools in the hands of the players at this point. Frankly, even GTA Online had stores to rob at this point. I just, I find it so difficult and hard to understand the design choices that Rockstar slash Take-Two have been making. Just like between the poor communication and just the general sense that like gamers aren't running the show, I don't have a lot of hope or any kind of optimism for what's coming, you know? And I've, I've been examining the disparities between the single player and the online. And the things that stand out to me are things like the depth of the NPC interaction, the availability of shops and online, like butcher shops or gun stores or all, all the places across the north and south of the map that are barren and empty, the lack of stores or motels or baths, and the fact that we have like our campsite as an alternative to those things, but no rested bonus or means of getting experience or any benefits really from being in camp other than core increasing, which is still kind of irrelevant. You know, the basic shops aren't even in every possible city, and there's not even robable trains yet. The truth of it is that online is really lacking for a lot of mysteries, and while most of us are complaining with a lack of endgame, it stands to reason there's not even much of a middle game. And the mission structure, format, and redundance combined with the timer and money just makes the whole thing super frustrating. You know, I, I just can't but help but wonder every time I hop online, how come I'm not having more random encounters with gold panners or safe crackers or the prison cell escapees? having missions or camps or any kind of story building elements with the NPCs, uh, the nuggets in the bottles or even, uh, you know, the NPCs that were panning for gold along the way or people you could just generally interact with. You know, there's no legendary animals, we don't have duels, and there's not even random stagecoaches. I don't understand why the NPCs don't want to ever initiate fights or get drunk. I don't know where all the gang members are around town, or where the Italians would be in San Denis. I don't know where the hot air balloons are, there's no bear traps. There's NPC clothes in the game, but they're coming over at a rate that's way slower than I can understand, considering how much of it was already in-game. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, let's look at the, the bear hat, or the most recent Russian hat. The most recent, the most recent Russian hat that was added to the game. You know, there's no prostitutes, there's no baths, you can't even sell meat to crips in your own camp. The north and south of the map are totally useless, and there's train tracks going out there with no trains. I just can't figure out for the life of me what's going on with this game and why, where all the content is. You know, and, and in lieu of that, I've just got in front of me on this page a random pile of ideas for things that they could add to this game to make it way better. And it's just things that we could use with our own content already present in it. Like, you could have more gang fights between other gang members. You could walk into, like, the O'Driscolls and the LeMoyne Raiders fighting. You could have a most wanted version on the map where whoever has high aggro could be chased by other players. You could set bounties at the sheriff's office or player bounties at Thieves Landing, like dynamic hit contracts. You could do... Like, there's just so much you could do. You could let players become wagon drivers or coach drivers to be, like, crazy taxi. You could have rare, rich NPCs that spawn with special loot. You could do drops. Even without explanation, you could do hot air balloon drops. You could do custom posse uniform. You could have caravans that trade or that you could rob. You could have multiplayer drinking games that lead to a belt buckle. You could have a tip reward system where if you help an NPC, maybe it gives you the location of a stash of gear or weapons. You could have so many mini games like a Jack the Ripper mini game or, like, a, a game mode where you collect a mask and become a melee weapon wielding murderer or just there's so much you could do you know even rodeo or horse breaking i don't know I, i'm just so i'm so overwhelmed with the amount of opportunity this game has to really produce and push fantastic and interesting content for the average consumer and i feel like we're just constantly getting shortchanged. uh this is predominantly a very very condensed version of what i had to say in my long-winded rant video but the audio on that was so bad and i'm hoping that i won't have the same problem on this one so, uh, I, message received, and so on and so forth, and I hope you guys will forgive me, and uh, I would love to hear your thoughts on it. I'd love to know if you think we're going to get a career update tomorrow. I would love to know if you think uh, that, you know, that Rockstar is just taking the time that it needs, and we'll get there slowly but surely. Uh, you know, it's it's interesting time, so we'll see what happens.